And this is Oscar. Together with our children, Addie and Gus, we have sold up to travel and find our patch of paradise. Come follow our adventures as we make our way around Australia. Outside of Dungog, um, this campground is called. I always forget. Tillagheri Creek, Tillagheri Campground. I'll put it at the bottom here. Um, so it's beautiful. Um, it's out just past um, Chichester Dam. We're in New South Wales. That's where Dungog is. For those who don't know, um, and it's beautiful. The weekend was busy, um, and couple groups of like younger people getting a bit yahoo-y um, but it's the weekend so we're here uh, Monday night now it's beautiful it's calm and um, there's only us and one other family um, and they're full-time traveling at the moment too so yeah it's very peaceful here um, we've got good reception with our Starlink so we'll be staying and Oscar will be working from here tomorrow and yeah, just chilling out down by the river. Someone's made like a little man-made pool here. Um, and the kids are enjoying it. They've got little friends they've made. So yeah, enjoying our stay for sure. Rain. It got rain all of last night, heavy rain. And we're meant to get rain today and tomorrow and the next day. And where we are, we're at a river crossing. So we're going to go check if we can get out because we're meant to leave tomorrow. So if we can get out today, we might have to. What so do you reckon? We'll have a look and we'll see what happens. But it's a pretty little. Crossing, it's only a little crossing, it's, it's just if it gets steep, too deep. It's just steep entry, so the water's probably Gushing. up a bit. Yeah. We'll go have a look. Oh, it's dark, we should have got a flashlight. Yeah, we're not leaving. I think we're stuck here. Yeah. That was only a trickle yesterday. Oh my god. There are signs that tell you that if um, it's yeah. raining, you can't get out, but we thought we'd try and beat it. Oh no, there's a tree that's fallen down too! <laughs> You're gonna have to move that tree with the winch before we go. Lucky we've got one other camper here with us. They're full timers too. Well, they're about to be. This is their first trip in their new van. It's fast. That's going to be deep. Like that's a steep entry and it looks shallow there. It gets deep quickly there too. It drops, yeah, it drops right off. So like my waist out there, I reckon. Yeah, and plus there's a tree there. I'm not going to cross anything while there's a tree across the No, you've got to move the tree first. I'll walk across it and we'll winch it out of the way if it's too heavy for me to move. It's <laughs> end Um, But hopefully we'll be alright for water because 
I'll just start catching some water. You'll start catching some rainwater, babe. This isn't very good footage, it's a bit grainy, but I just wanted to take you down and have a look firsthand. Couldn't find the GoPro, so I just grabbed my phone. It is beautiful here though, like weekend was busy like I was saying before, but there's just us and another couple and they've got kids. And there's kookaburras and there's all these beautiful birds and the river's gorgeous. And mates, our neighbours, <laughs> you when it's not flooded. Um, <laughs> our mates are um, put in a net, I don't know what he's fishing for, maybe yabby or something I guess. No, his net's probably gone actually. He didn't go and get it last night. But there's glowworms here, so we're going to check out the glowworms. He got a yabby. You oh, he got one. You were cooking dinner and he got a yabby. Oh, cool. Yeah, there's glowworms here in the... in the. Not, it's not a cave, it's just like a, just a rock, rock face, isn't it? Yeah. So we're going to do that last night, but it was just raining too heavy. Alright. Sounding off for now. Okay, update. Yay! The boys decided we were going to cross the river. The girls are unimpressed about it. So... see how this goes. Addy, you need to be quiet so we can concentrate now. I'm just watching what they're doing. Yes. <laughs> well, that experience was a bit hectic. Um, we bailed and went to Oscar's uncle's place. So he lives just outside of Stroud here for a few days. And then we're going to head off to Foster, that region. Um, it's literally just rained and rained and rained. So it was good to kind of have a house to go to. Um, kids can run around, they've been watching TV, um, that kind of thing. So did all of our loads of washing and dried everything. So it's been really good um, as a little base for a few days. But yeah, looking forward to the beach and going to Foster. We've got friends who live in that area. So we're actually staying at Sandbar. And yeah, we'll check out all the beaches. We've never been to Salido, Salado, how do you say it? Um, that beach before but we'll go to Elizabeth's and Bluey's and do all the normal things we do when we're there. Uh, we've been holidaying there since we were kids and teenagers so yeah it's nice to take our kids somewhere that we grew up going to. So yeah let's do it. up the tree. Oh my gosh. See. Should we go have a look? Yeah. We'll be careful. Yeah. Why? Because, because he'll rip our skin up him. Oof. That sounds terrible. Mm -hmm. What do you think, Gus? We need skins for our bones. <laughs> yeah. And then they don't fall out. Yeah. Where is he? Oh, there he is up in the tree. But he's just hiding in the tree. There he is. This is probably as close as we can get, Addy. Gussie, not... this is as close as you can get, okay? So, I, so then he Pretty here, hey? So he doesn't come? Yeah. Daddy's setting up. <coughs> hey, Daddy. Hey, Mummy. You like your jack? I like my jack. 
a good one. Yeah. What did I what flash? Which light flash? This one. That one? That's our blinker. Why do we need a blinker? Let's tell people which way we're going. We're right on a little river. Mm -hmm. I don't know Mom, if it's Probably it is, but... Look at the kookaburras. Beach? Shh. The beach is just down the road. Look at the kookaburras. They're going fishing in the water. Hey, kookaburra. It's so beautiful. Beautiful, aren't they? On our way to Saletto Beach. Yo. We haven't been here before, which yeah. is. Grew up coming Addy, to. Addy, just wait a second. Grew up coming to Pacific Farms like Bluey's, Bluey's. Boomerang, Elizabeth yep. Beach, and um, my grandparents used to have an apartment at Foster, so always in and around here, but never Saletto Beach. This is so, not the first for us. Yeah. But. Apparently, it, it's not. Nice. The other one too is, which is very exciting, this is us hitting the coast again for the first time since we left South Australia. So oh man, we're we need it. dinging for some salt water and waves. Yeah. And when we were in SA, it wasn't amazing weather by the beach. And then when the weather was good, we were like at, at bush. So yeah, we're super keen. Um, see what it's all about. And we'll go into Palms later and stock up on groceries. We're gonna have a fire tonight because we can. So yeah, we are might super have excited. To have a cheeky schooner at the recce as well. Yeah. Where are we going, guys? To the beach. I'm gonna jump in. I'm gonna put my snorkel on. Let's roll. I saw some guys coming from like over the top of the rocks. I used my head over. Look at this. Guys went rocky pool. Might just hang out here for half an hour. Let us know where I got to. Oh, that's beautiful. It's like big cliffs either side. It's gorgeous. There. And you walk over these rocks. There's that rock hole. Very pretty. And somewhere we've never been before, even though we grew up coming here as kids and teenagers. But yeah, nice.
Princess Ariel. Yeah. Yeah, she's a mermaid princess. Random car chats about who's your favourite princess. full lap. We'll go through Blueys and Boomerang. We'll do the full lap of... I know we're running late, right? Um, no, Power Patrol. Anyway. Power Patrol. Anyway. Let's show the beach when we get there. There's a big one, Addy! <laughs> steamy here. It's been raining all morning and now it's just steamy. My hair's frizzy. Anyway, we just arrived at a hip camp. It is so nice here. Um, the road in is a bit of a full drive kind of, you know, there's a few bumpy bits but was fine with our caravan and it had been raining so it was all good. Um, we're parked up here and there's the river. Can you see it? There. And it's like beautiful fresh water, there's birds, it's a cattle farm I think, um, and we're the only ones here, it's peaceful, there's just bushland all around us, and there is an epic, epic camp kitchen, so I'm just going to go up and show you, Oscar's making us some toasted sandwiches, the host lit the fire before we arrived for us, um, up in the camp kitchen so we could enjoy it. 